Hey everyone, Ben Bruce Hill Platt to Schools. What we're going to do today is I'm going to show you a little bit of an indoor basketball challenge that you can do. Obviously it's slightly different, but uh, what we're going to use is some household objects. If you have sort of basketball equipment and you want to try this outdoor, feel free to try this outdoor. Um, but I'm just going to show you a safer version that you can do indoors that won't cause any damage or anything. So what we're going to need to do is grab two things that we will use for this challenge is a basketball and a basket. So I'll show you two household objects that you can use as your basketball and your basket. So for your basketball, um, something nice and easy that we can all grab is a pair of socks. So I've got two different socks here. doesn't matter. It could be a pair. It can be odd ones out. Um, but what I'll do is I'll just show you here. So at the top, so you're going to put the two tops together just like that. And then you're just going to fold over, fold one into the other, and then create a little ball. And that is going to be our basketball. Nice and easy, okay? The other thing we need to grab is a basket. So the thing that I'm going to grab to use uh, for a basket is a bin. So it's just something that it can fall into just like that so that it will keep it in as well. Um, and that's what you can use. So you could use a bucket or something like that. Anything that you can um, just throw it into basically that can act as our basket. Okay. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to show you how to set up the challenge. I'll have a go of it just to show you how it works. And then you, you can have a go of it yourself and challenge your family to see who can get further along in the challenge. Right, so to set up our challenge, what we need to find is a bit of space, about approximately about 15 feet is what you're going to need, okay? Because there's going to be five different stages, each one is three feet apart. And then once you've found that, so I'll just show you here how I've set it up. So this is how to set up your little challenge that you're going to do. So there's going to be five stages altogether. As you see, as I'm walking along here, there's a marker for where each stage is going to be. So once you've set up your basket, so I've got my basket just here up on a ledge. That's where I'm going to be thrown into. You're going to count three feet away from each stage, okay? So the first one is three feet, as you can see. I've marked it there. That's going to be the first stage. Then there's going to be another three feet. Okay, and then another three feet and so on until you reach the fifth stage, okay? Because there's only five that you want to do. So again, three feet, yeah, and two, three. Okay, and that is the challenge set up. So now I'll show you how to do the challenge and then you can get right into it. Okay, right, now so now that I've showed you how to set it up, I'm just going to show you how, well, how it's done. So I'll just uh, try the challenge myself. So I go step up to my first stage Again, this is a nice, easy start off. Okay, and you just want to chuck it into your basket. And then you're going to come back to the second stage. So I'm at my second stage, stand behind, just got it in. Pushing back to the third stage here. Oh, we got it in. There we go. There we go. Going back to the fourth stage right here. Oh, I miss. So this is what happens if you miss. So then you go grab your ball and then you have to go back to the start again, okay? So you want to try and make five consecutive shots. So if you miss at all, then you have to go back to the beginning. So then I would go back to the first stage and then try and make my way back up again. Okay? If you manage to complete all five stages, why not give yourself another challenge by trying to do it back down? So starting out off at five and then making your way back down to the first stage. Okay, and that's how you do the challenge. So why not try it yourself? And then if you want to try to get some competition, test your parents as well or your siblings. A couple of tips for the challenge are try not to hammer it towards the basket. Try float it in because that way it'll be a lot easier. When you're trying to hammer it, it will definitely probably break something as well. So let's not do that. Um, be sensible of what you're doing here. Just try float it in and that'll be easier. You'll make more doing it that way. Also, if you can try it, put it up against the wall or up against a mirror. So as you see here, mine's up against a mirror. That's going to act like a backboard as uh, as you have in basketball. So if you can do that, it will make it slightly easier as well. So yeah, it's definitely not an easy challenge. Have a go of it. Challenge your family. See who can be. Uh, see who can get further along in the stages. And yeah, don't, this is one that you can do any day. It's, it's a good fun one to do. Um, so yeah, enjoy.